Hey guys, so today I thought I would do my makeup routine for sort of an event, but it's more of a casual event. I've just got people coming over for lunch um, for my granddad's birthday, so I just thought I would do my everyday makeup for then. I've got good natural lighting today, so hopefully it stays. Sorry about the shadowing a little bit. It's not the best natural lighting. It was either too bright or too dark. Um, so yeah, what I'm going to do first is I've got... Inglot YSM foundation in 41 and I've got light leisure concealer um, in the fit me Fa fit me range so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take the concealer and I'm going to apply it in a triangle form underneath my eye and I'm going to dot it on like so Go to the other eye too. Like that. I'm just gonna take some more. I'm just gonna apply some down the center of my nose on my chin. And then I'm gonna just do some on my major pimples. I'm just going to apply it to my pimples. I've got a lot um, and I don't want it to be like heaps noticeable that I've got concealer on because this does cause my skin to go a bit orange because no place in this world has a light enough foundation for me except for Inglot. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my baby kabuki brush. Usually I would use a foundation brush but mine's gone missing for some reason, so baby kabuki will do the job. And you're just gonna lightly tap it on the ones on your cheeks and chin and nose. Just to sort of blend it in. And with the ones under your eyes, what you're going to do is you're just gonna take this finger or this finger, I like to use this one, and you're just gonna so you're just going to tap the concealer and blend it all up under your eye. Now, I don't usually use primer. I should, but I don't own any. So what I'm going to do is I usually put some moisturiser on, but I've had a shower so I've already moisturised. So I've got my concealer on. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to take the Inglot YSM foundation in 41 and I'm just going to put a little bit on my hand like so. I probably won't need this much but because the concealer is not my colour I need to do a little bit extra to colour it up. Cover it. So then I've got about that much on my thing and I'm just going to take a little bit from the side at a time. I'm just going to apply it to my face. Make sure you blend it over your ear so it doesn't just sort of stop and down your chin. Some more. Do the other side of your face. I usually go symmetrical so I go there, there, there and then there. up through my eyebrows I'm just going to take a very small amount onto my chin and I'm just going to close my lips and go over there so you get underneath your nose another video of foundation and you do your forehead and you make sure you bring it up into the hairline. Now what I usually do, which makes it look a lot smoother, my pimples are really bad today, so that usually works a lot better. But I usually take my Coral Colors translucent powder but I'm all out of that and then I would usually resort to mode if I'm out of it and 
if I'm out of this one, I go to this one, but I'm out of that one too. So I need to go makeup shopping as soon as possible. So what I do next is I take um, Savvy by DB, which I think is designer brands, uh, an eye primer. I just take it and just apply it to the lid as so. You just got an eye primer on and sometimes you can even put a little bit in the corner here and it brightens up your eyes. So now I'm going on to my cheekbones and my cheeks so I'm going to use a bronzer. I can't decide which bronzer I want to use. I've got like a pinky coloured one with glitter in it or I've got just normal bronzer. Um, I don't know. I think I'll go with this one today. I'll just put very minimal on. So I'm going to take I'm going to take this brush here. It just came with the thing. It's not a very good quality one. But it's good because it's of the angle it is you can get right in your cheekbones. So I'm just going to tap it in there just very lightly. Just a little bit. Suck in your cheeks like a fish and just go inside underneath your cheekbones because you want to shadow it. Don't worry too much about the lines. You can see it's quite a dark line. Don't worry too much about that. We will blend it all at the end. So then I'm just going to make sure that lid goes back on because I have a tendency to drop all my makeup everywhere. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my designer brand's um, blush in the colour blush red. Just like that. I'm going to take this brush. It's um, a bow brush. I'm just going to take some blush onto here, tap it off, right now I'm just going to smile and do the apples on my cheeks backwards. Right now I look like a clown. <laughs> I'm just going to grab my foundation brush once again. I should already still have some foundation on it so it lightens it up a little bit. I'm just going to buff it all in, blend it and just make it look generally lighter. Alright, so now it's all blended in. What I'm going to do now is move on to eyes. Now what I'm first going to do is I'm going to take my Inglot 19P uh, blending brush. So it looks like this one. Nice little blending brush. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my Sun Kissed brand um, eyeshadow. So I've got a duo set here. I'm going to take the lighter colour. I'm going to apply that all over my eye. Now the primer that we put on earlier onto our eyelids, it stops the eyeshadow from giving those crease lines and it also lasts longer. Alright, what I'm going to do now is I've got Savvy by Designer Brands eyeshadow here. I'm going to apply this just to the lid. the darkest colour, just on the tip of the brush, I'm just going to apply it here. Volume Express Mascara. I'm just going to apply this to my lashes. Try 
by my Model Co. mascara. See how that goes. latte lip tint so it's beautiful bronze color which will match my dress so I'm just wearing a um, goldy brownie colored maxi dress with flats and a blazer I'm just gonna take my little finger into it and just apply it Thanks for watching, comment, like and subscribe and share with all your friends. See ya!